is up y'all? Emma Pearl here bringing you another taste test video. Highly requested, excited about it, but thinking about it all day. We're gonna try frozen pizzas. So today we have found seven different brands of frozen pizza. Allow me to introduce you to the cast of characters for today's video. Freshetta, you see it at every grocery store, you never buy it. Red Baron, I don't actually think I've eaten this. DiGiorno, they think that they are the best at all times and we will find out if that's true. H-E-B Rising Crust Pizza, Yeehaw Pizza. Great value Rising Crust Pizza, it's a great value. Good and Gather Signature Uncured Pepperoni Pizza, because if you're gonna eat frozen pepperoni pizza, at least it should be mildly fancy. Home Run In Pizza, it is from Chicago, it is not deep dish, I don't know what to believe. Of course, we cannot film a rating video without being as scientific as humanly possible or as scientific as I'm willing to be. So we have the pizza rating system. We will be rating all seven of our pizzas on the flavor, texture, and visual appeal. And then that will give us an overall score out of 30. I will also be guessing which pizza I think is which. Which I think this one's going to be really tough because I don't know if I have a palate that will be able to tell the difference between pizza, but we're going to find out. To make this even more scientific, I will be blindfolded as I taste the pizza. I wanted to add another category to the ratings. I wanted to see if the flavor was enhanced or didn't matter based on dipping in ranch dressing. I don't know if that's a Midwest thing. Let me know in the comments if you like to dip your pizza in ranch. I love to dip my pizza in ranch. This is the first pizza. Texture's pretty good. Crispy on the bottom, but kind of chewy in the middle. I like that. Oh. The flavor is honestly not as intense as I would like. Like I somehow can't even taste the cheese. Texture, I will give like a six. Taste, I will give a five. Let's check this baby out. Oh, I ate too much of it. Like it looks really nice and like baked. I will give the visual appeal a seven. It's like a pretty solid sauce to cheese ratio. I'm gonna guess that this is H-E-B. Deciding to make this video was the smartest thing I have done all week. This one is so much different than the first one. This one tastes cheaper. Taste, I'm gonna give this one a four. Mmm, this is kind of ugly. This cheese kind of looks a little too artificial for me. It doesn't look like it melted very well. And the crust just looks kind of gross. Uh, visual appeal, this one gets like a four. I didn't do the texture yet, did I? Texture will give a five. This pizza isn't very good. I don't know which one this could be. This is a hot take. I'm gonna guess that this one is good and gather. This is pizza number three. Ooh, it's heavy boy. This is hard because I don't know if it's getting in my mouth. That's what she said. This pizza is like thick with like five C's. This pizza is thick bordering on chunky, but the taste is okay. The sauce has a good tomato-y element to it. I can't taste the cheese. Why, where's all the cheese? Taste I'm gonna give a seven. I guess it's pretty solid. I like a thick pizza. I like a thick doughy pizza and this one's pretty dough. So I'm gonna give the texture a seven as well. It's like crisp on the bottom but like supremely chewy in the middle. Oh, I like this one. Here's our showpiece. I'm gonna give the visual appeal on this one like, um, like an eight. This looks great. It's crunchy on the bottom. Like you can hear that, but you hear like a hollow doughiness inside. Oh my God, I love this pizza. I'm gonna guess this one's DiGiorno. I love this pizza. I don't want this pizza to end. Order. Do you like pizza? <laughs> he does not like pizza. Ooh, this is dense. This is heavy. I don't know if y'all can see it. I can't see it. It's kind of floppy. Kind of bendy boy. This pizza tastes like alcohol. Granted, I haven't had alcohol in almost three years, but because I smelled this one, it smells like beer. Flavor is very strange. Flavor, I'm gonna give it a six. Texture, it's like, it's not crisp enough on the bottom to justify how squishy it is inside. Kind of lacking. Texture, I'll give a five. All right, let's look at this weirdo. This is so weird because it looks like a really cute little pizza. I'm gonna give the visual appeal an eight because this pizza looks just gorgeous. Tastes weirder than it looks. 
I'm gonna guess that this is Red Baron. Ooh, it's, it's pretty dense. The taste of this one is pretty legit. I feel like this one I can actually taste the cheese maybe. I can taste all the elements individually. I'm gonna give the taste on this one an eight. Texture is good, but I'm not in love with it. Like I wish the bottom was crispier, but it's still pretty good. Texture I'll give a six. Oh, look at that. It's gorgeous. This pizza is gorgeous. It's all golden and nice. A visual appeal on this one, I'm tempted to give it a nine. Like this is a pizza I wanna take home to meet my parents. Hey, I can't wait to eat it all week. <laughs> I don't know if this is a hot take. I'm gonna guess freshetta. Look at the inside of it. I wish the bottom was crusted with like cornmeal or something, but this is so freaking good. Who are you? I love you. I don't think I like this one. I definitely taste the cheese, but I don't think that I like it. The taste isn't bad though. All things considered, I'll give the taste a six. Texture gets a four. I just don't like it. It's so weird. It looks so cute. Look at him. It looks a lot better than it tastes. Visual, I'll give like a seven. It looks pretty good. I'm gonna say home run in on this one. I don't know though. All right, pizza number seven. Oh, very bendy. Is this a pepperoni in my hand? Somehow this one is significantly greasier, but not in a fun way. Is this a cheese pull? Is that what's happening right now? I can't tell. <laughs> Help. Help. Did I get it? No. <laughs> it's a mess, literally. <laughs> Taste gets a six. Texture is weird. It, it's not thick like I like, but it's pretty good. Except it kind of feels wet on the bottom. I don't know if that's just grease. Texture gets a five. Help. Oh, this pizza's so greasy. Here it comes. Not good. <laughs> uh, visual appeal gets a three. It's like too greasy. What are you? I love that the cheese is like pulls. Like if you combine that cheese with all the other pizzas that I really liked, that would be really sick. Kind of ugly and really greasy. The only brand I have left is Great Value, but I don't, Something in my heart tells me this is not great value. So I'm going to know my guess because it can't be great value. That means great value surprised me. Let's get after it. Let's, let's do this. So in last place was pizza number two with a score of 13. All right, you thought it was good and gather. Uh, it was Red Baron. Oh, wow. Uh, with a score of 14, number seven got sixth place. 14. You were, uh, forced into guessing it was great value, it was home run in. Oh, home run in, wow, yikes. Coming in fifth place was pizza number six with a score of 17. You thought it was home run in, it was good and gather. Oh wow, weird. Coming in whatever place comes after that one, number one got a score of 18. You thought it was H-E-B, it was Freshettas. Whoa, I don't know what's gonna happen next. Pizza number four got a score of 19. You thought it was Red Baron, it was H-E-B. Ew. Pizza number three got a 22. The only one you got correct. You thought it was DiGiorno, and it was DiGiorno. Whoa! Yo, does this mean what I think it means? Pizza number five got a 23. You thought it was Freshetta, it was Great Value. Oh my God! Great Value won! I can't believe it. Is that the one that I said I wanted to take it home to be my parents? Oh my God! So for some real life drama, we went and bought all these pizzas yesterday in the evening. And we went to Walmart last. They didn't have the great value pizza. And I was horrified. I was like, we have to have the great value pizza. Like if we don't have great value, this taste test is a flop. We can't do it. And so we went to a different Walmart today to see if they had the great value pepperoni pizza and they did. I can't believe it. Dude, roll that beautiful pizza footage. I can't believe it. <gasps> you ready for some ranch? I can't believe it. I'm shocked. Let me know in the comments, which pizza did you think would win? Are you as shocked as I am that great value won? 
I got a few more of these videos in the pipeline. More stuff I wanna try. If you have a great idea, a food category that I should give a taste test to, drop it in the comments below. If you disagree with any of this, if you think another brand has better pizza, do let me know, I'm very curious. Go try a great value of frozen pizza. You might be shocked with what you discover. I know that I was. If you enjoyed the video, please do subscribe. It helps the channel so much when you subscribe, so please do it. If you ever wanna come hang out, I stream on Twitch Monday, Wednesday, and Thursday, starting at 6 p.m. Central. Come join us, it's a ton of fun. I think I'm ready to go eat the rest of this pizza. I might microwave it a little bit. It's a little cold, but it's still good. So thanks for watching. Have an awesome rest of your day. And go eat some frozen pizza. Don't mind us. We will be eating pizza leftovers for the next couple of weeks. I'm excited. Thank you.